What's going on, Unfazed crew? Today we are at Portillo's in, uh, what are we, Surprise, Arizona, or is this Peoria? Peoria. We're in Peoria, Arizona. And we got some hot dogs. Very nice. Got some french fries with cheese. Love the cheesy dip. And uh, also they have delicious shakes. They have a chocolate cake shake, which has a piece of chocolate cake crammed down in there. So super healthy. As you can tell, I'm on a health food kick. And today we are joined by the great and powerful Alan Himmis. Alan, are, are you ready for your close-up? <laughs> anyway, so very excited. We're gonna eat, and then we'll get back with you in a second. I drank too much. Two. <laughs> nah, you stop that. <laughs> The hips don't lie. So here I am with Alan Himmis. Hello. Inside Arrowhead Mall. Time for a mall vlog, you know? So we went and had Portillo's. Really good stuff. Kind of hard to vlog in there though, just because they're constantly cranking 1950s music. And I'm not talking like good buddy Holly and stuff. It's usually like pretty obnoxious, like Frankie Valley and stuff. That's kind of like nails on a chalkboard. It's okay in small doses. I can do it for like half an hour, but. After a while, I'm kind of like, okay, that's enough. That's enough 1950s for me. But yeah, the food was good. Very filling, very satisfying. Still working on a shake right now. And now we're just kind of kind of roam around the mall and see what we can see. I think this is a great mall. A lot of stores here. And did you know a few weeks ago, there was a piece of glass up there and a man walked past and it fell on his head and there's blood everywhere. Nice. I don't know what happened to the guy. I hope, I hope he's, he's all right. I mean, he made a lot of money off it. I'm sure. Oh yeah, let's hope we can enjoy it. It's somewhere over here. Whoa, jeans are back, baby. I didn't know they ever went away. I can guarantee you the guy can't name two Guns N' Roses songs. Here's a look at what movies are playing right now if you really want to date the video. Suicide Squad, I'm gonna watch it just because on no expectations we have to review it, but I can already tell you, it's gonna be trying too hard to be funny but probably some good action, so we'll watch it. Snake Eyes, nobody cares. Jungle Cruise, stupid. Doesn't that look dumb? It looks so dumb. I feel like rocking that hat is just demeaning at this point. Emily Blunt's cool, I like her, she's a, she's a cutie. But uh, I don't know, man, I feel like it's just, uh, it's been done, like we've seen this movie, you know? Old, probably disappointing. M. Night Shyamalan, I haven't liked anything he's done in like 15 years. Space Jam, come on, why bother? Why bother? Is this uh, not even, no, this is like an advertisement. <laughs> okay. It's great though. Yeah, it looks really good. See it. it. Looks really good. Uh, the Green Knight, huge disappointment. Huge, man, it looked so cool. Ended up falling asleep in the theater twice. I swear to God, I fell, I fell asleep, I woke up, I fell asleep again. It was so boring, the story sucked. Stillwater, heard this is supposed to be good. Uh, Matt Damon playing a uh, like Trump supporter. I don't really know anything about the story, but uh, it's supposed to be a really good performance from Matt. Black Widow, sexy. Actually not a terrible movie, surprisingly. Kind of enjoyed it. It wasn't perfect by any means, but it was fun to turn your mind off to and watch. Nine Days actually looks super interesting. Tony Hale especially, Buster Bluth. Gummy Bears. Escape Room, probably stupid. I do not get these movies. I don't understand the fascination. We're family. Uh, the Dodge. Uh. And there she is again. Hello. Hello. I'm just vlogging. I used, to, I used to work in this AMC. Oh, really? Yeah. Good times. And bad times. But mostly good. Here's where I get all of my Legos. Oh, check it out, Seinfeld. That's actually pretty cool. I know James wants this. Pretty cool. I feel like they're gonna try really hard to push Seinfeld into like the meme era and like it's not gonna, it's not gonna work, but. Yeah. 
Yeah. This is actually pretty cool. Yeah, look at all the Spider-Man stuff. Daily Bugle. <laughs> I'm getting you this for Christmas, Alan. Just beer. Yep. Times. Nothing quite like Arrowhead Mall. Oh, look at these baby angels over here. And the dogs, too. Oh my god, how cute can you be? How cute can you be? Oh, hello there. Hello there. Oh, pink eyes, little pink eyes, naked eyes. Oh my goodness. How cute. Hello, babies. What do we have here? What a little baby. Shit stains on the wall. Shit stains on the wall. Oh my god. It's like a Kmart bathroom up in here. Me and Benjamin used to come to this mall and hit on the chicks. Good times. Yeah. Back in the olden days. And we were just saying, like, it's usually really crowded. Like, last time I came here, it's usually super crowded. I feel like any mall that's actually still alive, like Arrowhead or Fashion Square, at least as far as the Phoenix metropolitan area goes, they're usually like super stupid busy. And this is nice. This is like yeah, not is too nice. much, you know? It's not annoying. Yeah, like there's still people, but it's not, uh, it's not overkill. You know what I mean? Not a lot of little kids running around. Yeah, which is nice. Which kind of sucks for me though. <laughs> yeah, Alan. Alan loves the kids. I, yeah, that's the only reason I come to the mall. <laughs> that's why he brought his truck and some rope and everything. And in about a week, they'll put up Christmas lights. One thing I like about Arrowhead, it's a fairly clean mall. Surprise. Yeah, you think it'd be more trashy, but uh, they do a good job of uh, keeping it nice enough. Here's the food court over here. Good times. Yeah, we used to come to this mall a lot, especially when we were teenagers. Good times. Yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> Don't jump, Alan. What? Now this place is awesome. Pangea Dinosaur Grill. I think this appeared in one of our videos before, but uh, just wanted to kind of document it because it's pretty cool. It's a fun theme. Hey, what's up? Holy shit! Oh, it makes sense. Alan, what's your earliest mall memory? Um when I was a wee little lad ah. and I went to Metro Center. Oh yeah, what do you remember about Metro? I remember I to, just walking around with my mother. Yeah, do you remember the fountain that they had? Oh yeah, I remember the fountain Kate. sitting on Santa's lap. Oh yeah, <laughs> nice. <laughs> we have to make it all sectional now. <laughs> Real mature. Yeah. Do you remember KB Toys? Yep, I remember KB Toys. The little dog that was always in there. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> and it would like do flips. Yeah. Yeah, I remember I, that. I remember that. And uh, I used to go to the Van Skate Park there. Very cool. Yeah. And uh, yeah. That's. I don't have anything exciting. Yeah. Same here. I remember pretty much that exact same, <laughs> exact same stuff. Yeah. I remember us going to uh, Castling Coasters a few times. That was fun on the outskirts of Metro. That was a good time. Yeah. <sighs> and then Arrowhead, man. I don't know, I don't have any early memories of Arrowhead, but I have like high school memories of Arrowhead. Yeah. And it's still pretty much the same. I mean, stores come and go, but it's got the same vibe, you know? Yeah. I've always thought the Hallmark store would be a perfect place to do a drug deal. Who would ever expect it, man? You go in, you put the drugs like over here in like a, a mug or something, and then you have the money over in like the gift cards area, or not the gift cards, but like the greeting card area. Great place to do a very, secretive drug transaction. 
No one would ever guess. Oh boy. You want want to catch COVID real quick? <laughs> Lick this right here. What kid wants to play on this? Come on. Seriously, it's terrifying. The hips don't lie. Hello? I think she likes me. There's always a kid screaming when I try to record, I swear. <laughs> anyway, it looks like a sad little, Jesus, I give up. Looks, ah, forget it. <laughs> Flower bomb. Oh, no. Oh, oh, there he is. This reminds me of Back to the Future. 1.15 a.m. Twin Pines Mall. Those were the days. Well, thanks for joining us, guys, for another impromptu vlog. This was kind of fun. I like the challenge this week of trying to do one video every single day this week. I've been successful so far. Definitely go check out the other video that I posted yesterday, the Alfred Hitchcock Hotel video. I'm gonna put a link right here so you guys can check it out. That video is not getting the views that it should, so please go show it some love. Check it out. And as always, guys, Remain unfazed. Later. <laughs>